What is gradient of a scalar field? Consider air on the Earth's surface. We know that density is a scalar quantity. We also know that density of air is same at equal height from the Earth's surface. But as we move away from the Earth's surface, density of air decreases. Since density depends on its position in space, therefore it can be represented as a function of three axes x, y, and z. Now consider any point, say A, in space, having a density d. If we take the partial derivative of d at point A with respect to the axis x, y, and z, and then add them using the vector sum, we get a vector quantity. The magnitude of this vector quantity indicates the maximum rate at which the density increases, whereas the direction of this vector indicates the direction at which the density increases the most. Such a vector quantity is known as the gradient of density of air. Thus, gradient of a scalar field is a vector that represents both the magnitude and direction of the maximum space rate of increase of a scalar field. Mathematically, gradient of a scalar field is expressed as where del is the vector operator. It can also be expressed as or note that gradient of a scalar field at any point is perpendicular to the tangent drawn at the surface where the scalar field remains constant. The related terms are